Warning, the following video is part of a series that is for educational purposes only. Please do not enter the deep web unless you know what you're doing. What's happening guys, my name is Alex and welcome back to a brand new deep web video. It is Monday, so it's a new deep web Monday video for you guys. And in this video, we're gonna go down, we're gonna go deep actually, we're gonna go pretty deep. Let's just say that because I just wanted to you know, explain to you guys and tell you guys about something that's been going on for the deep web for a long time and basically the title of this video is like the most terrifying game because there is actually a game on the deep web that you can play and I have no idea like why you should even play it in the first place um, but as you guys can see we were on Tor browser as always and the first thing that I'm going to explain to you guys is the, the, the game that I'm talking about is called Sat Satan. The concept of the game is you're walking through dark hallways, very long hallways, and during the game you're hearing, like I believe people said you, you're hearing uh, actual real sounds of people getting killed or tortured or screaming, and it's so fucking fucked up. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just grab the Wikipedia link of Sat Satan, uh, not on the deep web, but just on regular Google. So let me just grab the link real quick, and let's read some fucked up stuff. Okay guys, so, as you clearly can see right here, the D-Web is basically like a like like a like an endless platform like I showed you guys. But this is just the, like a game on the D-Web, which is called Sad Satan, as you can see at the top. And basically, I'm just going to read like some things that's like listed right here. Listen carefully and read with me. And a lot of people are saying like, Alex, this is clickbait. I thought you were going to play the game. Well, guys, I can tell you guys that there are some images uh, popping up randomly of abuse, whatever. I cannot show it on YouTube. Let's just say that. Or I need to blur the entire video. We'll see. First of all, let me read what's on the Wikipedia page so you guys will know what I'm talking about. Okay, guys. So in an interview with Kotaku, the channel's owner claims to have downloaded the game from a Tor hidden service after receiving a tip from an anonymous subscriber. The subscriber in turn claims to have found the link via the deep web internet forum from a user only known as Z ZK. Initially, some followers were skeptical of the game fearing it may contain gore or child pornography in it. However, the owner of Obscure Horror Corner shared that. So far in his playthroughs, the game had no contained any such material. That sounds a little bit better though. Following with Kotaku interview, a subreddit slash r slash satsatan forum to discuss the game, quickly releasing the dot onion address provided by Obscure Horror Corner contained invalid characters. Three days later, another interview with the Obscure Horror Corner owner appeared on Kotaku, claiming that the link was purposely given in error since the game itself then in fact contains such graphic material and the obscure horror corner channel owner did not want to be responsible for any disseminating such material minutes before the updates. A new version of the game was posted to 4chan by someone claimed to be ZK, claiming that obscure horror corner had, had not been showing their viewers the true sad Satan. Members of the 4chan community downloaded this version of the game and attempted to play. Some users complained that their computer began to run sluggishly and a few even reported that their computer became completely unresponsive while trying to run the game. Few users have ever reported that their computer had not turned on anymore after running this version of the game. One Reddit user attempted to play the game with, with a live USB instead of their computer's main hard drive. Neither when they tried to boot into the computer as normal, the computer failed to load. This version, dubbed as clone by most of the R Sat Satan community, contained images of violent gore and some child pornography, some of which was accessible right title screen of the game. A version of the game with a pornography removed, often called the clean version, was created by Redditor, subsequently redistributed in hopes that people who went out to download the game would download it instead of the clone, which contained the graphic imagery. So essentially what we are reading here is that the game is basically you're walking through dark halls and there are images popping up of some fucked up thing. I have no idea, like I've never played the game like in my life and if you guys want to see like me playing the actual sad satan game which is going to be pretty fucking sickening make sure to smash the like button down below or you can vote yes on the card uh, in the corner of the video. So this is basically the most terrifying game on the entire deep web. And don't go ahead and, and blame me for clickbait because I, I'm not playing the actual game in this video. No, I'm just telling you guys and making you guys aware of this. Like there's so many other things in PayPal account. There's so many other things in drugs than, than weapons, than anything. You even have games on the deep web and everything. And one of them is called Sad Satan. I will leave the Wikipedia link in the description from Sad Satan so you guys can check it out and read it yourself. Because actually it's a, it's a pretty long article though, but still it is pretty fucked up. So I have no idea guys, 
If you want me to go ahead and play the game, make sure to let me know uh, by smashing the like button, like I said a few minutes ago, because I just want to be make sure that you would like when I'm going to play that game, it's going to be a the video. The video is going to blow up. I'm going to. I'm just going to say that. So basically, this is the sad state in Wikipedia page, and we have been reading a lot. And I cannot tell. I can tell you guys already. This is not a game that you want to play regular at night or even like even anywhere. I have no idea. This game has been. Like even j guys, just think of it. I don't know why, why am I wearing sunglasses. Think about this, guys. What kind of person is taking the time to create this game to uh, gather sounds from people getting killed or tortured or anything, anything like that? Who is going to take the time to even you know write the game and make and make the the images appear? Like who is taking the time for that? It's so crazy. Uh, so I might play the game. I'm not sure. I'm actually pretty. Um, like I'm, I, I don't like I don't like to play the game, guys. I just I just don't like to play the game. So if you want to see the game, make sure to support this video, and I will see what I can do. I'm not promising anything. Like I'm gonna play uh, the, the Sad Satan game next Monday. I'm not promising anything, guys. But that's basically for this video. This is this this is the worst and terrifying game I ever come across on the entire deep web. But as you guys can see, we're not on the deep web right now. We're just on the regular Wikipedia page. Uh, but I can switch to the Tor browser, that's no problem. So I think in order to uh, make sure to go ahead and try to download the game, I have to go on Tor browser right here and I have to like, you know, look up like Sad Satan download. And if you guys, I have no idea, like if I, if I want to play the game, I have to download the game and downloading something from the deep web is not a good idea at all sometimes or even all the time. It is that fucked up guys. So I don't know, I'm gonna end off this deep web video guys right here. I just wanna make sure that you guys are all safe and that you guys know what will come because I might play the game in the future. So that's it for this deep web video, guys. I really want to thank you guys for watching, and that's uh, that's all that I have. That's all that I have. That's all that I, that's all that I have for you guys today. So that's it for the video, guys. Thank you so much for the continued support. Thank you guys for liking and commenting on this video. I really want to thank you guys for watching, and make sure to smash the like button down below for more videos. And I really want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for the continued support. I'll see you guys next Monday for a new deep web video. So I'll see you guys next Monday.